What's up everyone, Kita Sean here. So we're here with the final Camelot guide video, the sixth and final, and we're gonna go ahead and talk about the last boss of Camelot, Arturia Lancer. So there's gonna be two fights with Arturia Lancer, and honestly, they're gonna be pretty hard. Like she's arguably the hardest boss fight in Camelot compared to Gawain. Like personally, I actually think she's a little harder than Gawain because of her noble phantasm. But other than that, uh, let's go ahead and talk about HP strategy and how to defeat her. So the first fight with Arturia Lancer, she's gonna have 592,242 HP, and the second and final fight, she's gonna have 600. 71,058 HP and you're gonna go ahead and treat both of these battles the same way. So Arturian Lancer's gimmicks aren't really gimmicks, they're actually her real skills. Like when you summon her as a servant, she'll have the same skills as her boss fight, but she allows herself to activate charisma immediately. So literally on the start of the first turn, boom, charisma, and then she spams her MP charge skill every turn. And then not only that, her noble phantasm hits through evade and invincibility. So any of your servants with those skills are basically useless. So the servants that you want to bring against Arturia are servants that have anti-Arturia or anti-Dragon. Siegfried and Mordred fit that perfectly because Siegfried has anti-Dragon, Mordred has anti-Arturia. Now they also have Saber classes as well so they'll do a lot more damage onto Arturia Lancer. So you also want to debuff Arturia as well and the perfect servant to do that is going to be Waver. Waver is perfect for everything, I mean he's just one of the best casters in the game even in the JP version he still is like considered the best caster so waiver he allows you to put all those debuffs with his noble phantasm he allows you to get MP gain attack up defense up crit up waiver does the whole shebang so waiver if you can bring him definitely do that you can also bring servants that have MP stun so Hasana the Serenity who's gonna be new in the gacha soon you can definitely bring her and of course because evade and invincibility are going to be useless against Arturia. You can bring servants that have guts so that you can keep reviving your servants. So Hercules obviously has evade but also has guts and not only that if you have him at bond 10, hey, works out very well. So Hercules is actually a pretty good pickup. Uh, you can also bring in Ku Alter. You can also bring in Irish Shield because she can heal and she can also attach guts to all your servants. So uh, yeah, definitely bring any of those servants there that will help you out. Uh, but yeah, it's it's actually a very, very hard battle, guys. So definitely, if you go in without a plan, then you're going to get wrecked. So definitely go in uh, with, a, with a team that will help you uh, strategize against Arturia Lancer. Also, another servant you can technically bring is Heroine X because of her anti-Arturia trait and not only that she has a stun ability but it's not as reliable so you'd probably want to stay away from her if possible and just bring Siegfried or Mordred but if you don't have any of those servants and you for some reason have a uh, heroine X then yeah bring her because she will help she'll do extra damage onto her but uh, if possible bring Mordred or Siegfried because um, they'll do a lot more damage onto Arturia Lancer. So that was my six part guide video for Camelot. I hoped it helped. Again, I'm not the best when it comes to these guide videos. I mean, there are a whole bunch of other YouTubers that do better jobs than me. But if you guys really, really want me to make these guide videos, I will do it. But for now, um, that was my Camelot video. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. And again, I hope it helped. But if you guys, again, want to see more videos like this, go ahead and tell me in the comments down below or message me on Twitter or Discord and I'll keep doing it. But anyways, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next one and good luck on Camelot, guys.